Hey everybody, it's your girl KT and welcome back to KT the Publicist. Here on this channel, we talk about business, career, and a sprinkle of lifestyle here and there. If you're new to the channel, thank you and I'm going to let you know now, you have now become a part of the family which is called work besties because that's all we talk about is work i'm just i'm just playing that's not all we talk about but majority of the channel is talking about career and business so hence work besties but thank you guys for staying tuned into this video today's video is actually a business talk video so these are the sit down videos that I talk with you guys on a one on one basis about various topics and how it relates to business and whatever thing you can think of. So today's topic is what is a publicist and the four things you should expect when you acquire a publicist for your brand or your business. If you missed the video, I talked about uh, previous what public relations is and my journey into public relations so if you missed that video I have it linked in the cards above so you can check it out pause this video go watch it and then come back so you'll know exactly what I'm talking about when I refer to certain terms about publicists and all that good nature so like I said I'm not going to talk too much because I'm going to be telling you guys a lot of information. So sit back and let's go ahead and get straight on into the video. She trying to tell right now you in her way. So, as a publicist myself, I get the question a lot, what does a publicist actually do? So that could really depends on your business or brand, but what a publicist typically does is someone who builds strategy around building up your reputation. So that could look like anything, but the main objective is to build and connect you with the media to help you build a positive rapport within that community and then also pushes you out to your target audience via these various media platforms. It's our job and duty to make sure that you are always represented in the best light as possible. And then also when you're not in that best light, what measures you need to take to basically sway or, you know, change up or course correct the reputation that you have moving forward. So all right guys, so now that you know what a publicist does, here are the four things that you should expect when you acquire a public relations or publicist for your business or brand. The first thing you should expect from your publicist is that they're your advocate. As a publicist, our duty is to make sure that you're represented in the right way. So we have to be an advocate for your brand or business. Being able to really understand the why behind your business so we can correlate that to the media to be able to pitch you out for brands and then also be in the second set of brand voices for you so we'll know what to ask and what questions that best fits for your brand when we are pitching you out to meet. The second thing you should expect from your publicist is that they're real strategies. Like I stated, public relation is very a strategy driven field of study to be in. A person should know a strategy on how to connect you to the media and also be able to strategize how to get the maximum results for you and your business or your brand. The third thing you should expect your publicist to be skilled at is crisis communication. As much as we love when things go right all the time, your publisher should be able to expect the unexpected and be able to have a plan related to what happens if the worst is supposed to happen. So your 
publicists should really understand crisis communication and how that really relates to what you are going to do in your business just in case that worst does happen there's already a plan in place so there's no waiting period there's no uh scratching the surface about what happened you have a plan ready to be executed at the moment's notice the fourth and final thing you should expect from your publicist when you acquire one is someone that has time management or are very stickler about timelines. We know as publicists that the news cycle is very much a short notice. Most of the time things happen in a split of a second or within 24 hours and now they're moving on to another story. So we know as a publicist that we have to be on stricter timelines and to make sure that you have the information that is needed and that we know what's going on in your business at all times to make sure we meet the deadlines and timelines of what is going to be best for your brand and business, especially when it comes to the hottest things that's out in the news and how it relates to your brand or your business so there you have it those are the four things you should expect from a publicist who works with you and it is a very beneficial uh services to think about outsourcing for your business uh public relations is not something that happens overnight many of your publicists have you know obtained degrees actually went to school or picked up as a trade and have done many hours of doing public relations to be able to give you actually results that can basically make or break your brand so i would suggest that you would look into finding a publicist for your business even if you're starting off on a small scale so that you can understand uh how this public relations work with your business and your brand and just in case you don't know a publicist i am open i do have my own business which is kgt communications and we are accepting consultation calls for quarter two this is not a call to book you or anything of that nature um this is really to help you guys learn what public relations is and how that could be translated into your business so if you're looking for a consultation call you can always visit us at www.kgtcommunications.com and as always if you know of a business brand or owner that needs this video do not forget to like comment share this video and then also let your work bestie know or business bestie know you have an advocate here at kt the publicist and for them to subscribe and hit that notification bell so again thank you guys for tuning in and i'll see you in the next video bye y'all